In this video, I'm going to present how to use the Unity IAP sample project. You first want to go to the Unity forum. The address is given there at the bottom of your screen. And scroll down to the Unity IAP subforum. Go ahead and click on that. And then at the, one, at the top, you'll see one of the posts that says Sample IAP Project. Click into there and go ahead and click on the zip file to download it. And once it's downloaded, go ahead and click on it to open it up in Windows Explorer. And choose Extract All. And once it's done uncompressing, go ahead and click into the top level directory there. And then in the address bar above, right click, choose copy, and that'll copy the correct path into the clipboard. You can then close all these files. Go ahead and start Unity. Choose open and then right click and paste the path we have in the clipboard. Hit enter once and then select folder to load the project into Unity. Choose continue. You probably have a more recent version of Unity than the project was originally created in. And if you get prompted to upgrade IAP at this point, go ahead and choose no. We're going to uh, upgrade IAP later. So go ahead and click into Scenes and open up the My Scene. And I'm using the middle wheel to scroll back and click and drag to get the scene into position. Or you can just click on the, the Game tab. Now go over to the Services window and uh, down to the IAP section and choose Update. Choose Install Now at this point. And eventually you're going to get to a uh, dialog that uh, asks you to update the Unity API. Um, you want to select uh, Yes, I've made a backup. There's the prompt right there. You must select Yes to that. It's very important or IAP will not install correctly. So let it go through this process. And once it's done, you can go up to the Window menu, choose Window, Unity IAP, IAP Updates to confirm that you have the, the updated version, in this case 120.1, .1, which is the latest version. So that's it. In the next video, I'll show how to use this project. That's it for now. Thanks.